Bowling Green aiming for win number 100 inside the show, hosting Norfolk State. First half, Trey Diggs swings it to Joe Reese in the corner. Open lane lays it in. Falcons up two. Myron Gordon drives to the hoop off the glass. Just two of his 19 on the night. Falcons led 39-37 at the break. In the second, Diggs misses the three. No worries. Daquan plowed in there for the cleanup. It's going to force a Spartan timeout. But from there, Norfolk State would take over. Tyrese Jenkins to Joe Bryant. Buckets back-to-back -back by the Spartans as Norfolk State comes away with a 90-84 win. Britt Del Barba joins us now from the Stroh Center. Norfolk State, a preseason favorite in the MEAC, came into the Stroh Center and spoiled the Falcons' perfect record at home, while the Spartans kept their undefeated overall record alive. The Falcons had a two-point lead at the break before falling behind midway through the second half and were just never able to close the gap. Now, this is a young Falcons squad, and they're still very much learning how to play together. It's, you know, building our chemistry up, you see that everyone's committed to and unconditionally committed to our team. So. Uh, I think that's our biggest takeaway, but you know, how when we bring energy and how we defend, you know, how we can get out to a real good lead. Our defense, we want to turn our defense into offense. We did a great job of that early and we let it slip away. You know, the first media timeout or the first timeout he called, uh, we jumped on him to start the second half and then it was like, ah, oh, it's over. We can relax and exhale and uh, we can go and cruise the rest, of the rest of the way, and that's not how basketball works. So um, we got to know once we jump on a team, we got to stay on a team, stay on them, and stay with that energy and that effort. We just got to be a little bit more consistent with it. Um, we did have our moments, but the game is a 40-minute game, so uh, just being more consistent with that is you know, what we have to fix. Bowling Green is still seeking their 100th win in the Stroh. The Falcons are back home Tuesday against Milwaukee. Reporting from Bowling Green, Britz Albarba, BCSN.